fuck YouTube and fuck their non-advertiser policy and fuck everything that goes to that fucking thing and fuck everyone who ever thought that would be a good idea fuck them and fuck political correctness and fuck everything that has to do with them implementing this fucking bullshit on this fucking site how about that for non-advertiser friendly huh how about that you fucking cunts they started to demonetize my videos because of this fucking non-advertiser fucking do stupid shit that they're implementing and hurting us creators for I don't know I'm thinking fucking time over the last couple of fucking years because they're fucking incapable of dealing with their own fucking shit so they decide to fucking come on us down whose money they're fucking taking every fucking month and I can't fucking believe I'm working for these fucking cunts over there that don't give a fucking shit and flying fuck about everyone else but them fucking selves so hey everyone how's it going here not so well as you can see I went mental because they demonetized a couple of my videos which probably means they're going to demonetize a lot of them because I said fuck in a video that's why I went mental and said fuck about 100 times in a minute because I don't give a fuck anymore about them and I hope they fucking rot in hell and I hope they fucking go down and one day that I can go on another website and do serious work there without their fucking bullshit controlling my fucking actions every fucking time that I try to do something on this fucking website. They don't understand that swearing is also an expression of your state, mental or physical at the moment. You know, when you stab your toe and then you go, ah, oh, fucking god damn it, fucking, you don't go, oh no, booby, oh, boo, boo, boo. You don't go that. You go, a motherfucker, I'm gonna fucking kill the next person that I fucking see next to me because I stabbed my toe and it fucking hurts. Right? You react like that. You don't go crying to your mama. Oh, mommy, no. I hurt my toe. Nah, fuck that. I don't know how this works, by the way. I don't know if someone is reporting your videos for containing offensive language or some shit like that. Or does YouTube automatically do that? If it's the case of someone flagging my videos because I said fuck or something else, then I don't know what to tell you. You need to mend the fuck up because that's not an excuse for flagging any kind of video with swearing on YouTube because you're not protecting your children. That's bullshit. That doesn't mean you're becoming a better parent. You're not. You're just fucking up lives of serious content creators that want to make money doing this and that are passionate about their, their fucking job. There's always an alternatives to one content. So if you don't like my fucking content, go to a fucking another site and do your fucking bidding there. But don't flag shit, don't fuck with people's livelihoods because it's not funny. You think it's funny? You might be laughing right now because I am went mental. That's all right. But if you're the person that is flagging videos on YouTube for no fucking reason, or if you want to tear down the competition, I don't know, then you're a fucking cunt. You're not a good parent. Simple as that. If your kid can't deal with fucking few swear fucking words in a fucking long video, then what the fuck are they going to do in their life? When fucking bad times come, huh? When the winter comes... No, sorry, not the winter. What do you think will happen to your kid when hardship comes? I don't even want to tell you what I've gone through in my life. You would not fucking believe the shit that I had to go through in my life and I'm only 30. It made me a stronger fucking person. If you're trying to protect your kids, if you put them in a bubble, you're going to make situation a lot worse. Everyone normal will agree with that. Especially if you're trying to protect them from a few swear words. Don't you think they swear in their free time, in their schools and whatnot? Of course they fucking swear. We all did. Where do you think we learn our language? We learn it from movies, from this, from that. And then we fucking repeat at each other in school. That's how you learn to swear. Doesn't matter if one kid didn't watch the movie. Other 15 did, and they will swear at this guy, so he will then remember that fucking word, and then he will throw back at them something even meaner. Which is alright, that's how you grow up. I mean, I'm talking mostly about boys here, so... 
I don't think girls function like that. I hope they do not function like that. Because then they are the same animals as we are. Which I still fight to this day that we are not. <laughs> Although when I see some feminist movements these days, god damn those cunts, they are worse than us by far. You know what's the worst thing about people like that? Their stupidity. I don't give a fuck if someone is black, white, yellow, purple, green. I don't give a fuck what your religion is. I don't give a fuck about anything. What I do give a fuck about is when such a person is given airtime and it talks for everyone. Which is bullshit. They're not. They are a small minority always. And their stupidity should be kept hidden. They should never get any airtime, but we know our beautiful media these days. Sensationalism all the fucking way. Because that's what people want to hear. So that's why these stupid fucks have been given airtime. I tend to watch a lot of rebel media and, and other funny videos of people complaining about who God knows what in America. It's funny for us Europeans to watch that. Because, you know, most of you don't have anything to complain about. Do you want to come over here? Live on Balkan or somewhere like this? Or Asia? Do you want to try Asia? Maybe Southeast Asia where poverty is unbelievable? Trust me, you know, you guys have nothing to complain about. People are overthinking things and unfortunately they have too much time to spend on such nonsense. But that's all a political agenda anyway. Jesus fucking Christ, look at me fucking became a political fucking YouTube channel in a matter of fucking minutes. Yeah, I should stop talking. Fucking hell, they're gonna to tear down my channel if I continue like this. But I'm gonna put this video up, I don't give a fuck. I'm not going to monetize it anyway. Because this can be considered as a channel update, as I already told you guys that they are going to be at free, although it's not technically an update. But there you go, a rant from a mad person. I don't think you have enjoyed this one. I'm expecting a lot of dislikes, but hey, what can you do? Thank you all and see you soon.